Llama's <laughs> <laughs> great. <laughs> Romance. Wobby Yabbik! Wobby Yabbik! Huh? Wobby Can we buy some food? That'd be great. <laughs> what was that? She may be hungry. Well, that's great. But if she stopped walking off, it'd be better. Where's she going now? <gasps> she went to get some grub. And they were like, No, Penny, we're closing. It's all going down now. I think it just closed. I think it said like five till midnight or something. A sleepover? Sounds great. You need to come and meet Doyle. Actually, I need to bath him. I'm talking about planes and stuff here. <laughs> Freight? Planes? Yeah. I always put my packaging in the bin. I recycle, says Penny. But I don't like insects. Fast cars? She needs a toilet. I can tell by the way she's walking. Poor Penny. Wait, I invited her to stay the night and she said yes, so where's she going? Um, do we just go home now then? I invited her over and I think she said yes, but I don't know if she's going to automatically appear at the house. Apparently not. Unless she's going to walk in later. That was weird. Okay, well. At least everything's working in here. Is she going to turn up or what? I have to make sure I hear a knock. Hang on. Make sure that she can let herself in. Allow access to. Yeah, we'll let them in. If they show up, they can come in. Oh, the cat's scratching the sofa now instead of my bed. That's cool. Oh, kids. <laughs> Time for your bath. Oh, what's Jeff up to? Social hygiene and fun bars are minimal. Stop scratching! See, I need to train the cat not to do this. Pet car. Change outfit. Let out. Pick up. No, it's not do that. Let's cancel that. Oh man, can you make a bit more of a mess? Yeah, well, the cat's not allowed in the bedroom anymore. But one of his objectives was to train an animal, I think. Where's Penny? She's not here, dude. She's supposed to come. It's a reek. Penny is sleeping. 
Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. It's outrageous. Right, stop reading that nonsense and read something useful. Read. Oh, do you know what? I can't write a book anymore because we don't have a computer. That is a big problem. Like, he's going to have to go to the library or something. Oh, man. Or we could just sell some of this stuff that's not being used. Those cat scratches are a complete waste of time. Right. Can't afford it. Eight hundred dollars. It's outrageous, man. Okay. Right. An excuse note. What? What better use of equipment writing skills than to trick hapless authority figures into excusing Sims from their responsibilities? No, we'll write a short story. Velo634, thank you very much for subbing. Welcome to Nouse Velo. Can we give Velo a nutty welcome, guys? Right, we need a name for this short story. Uh, anybody think of a good title? Name of the book. Name of the book. Short story. Good night, Jabgon. Doll's Dangerous Day of Squirrels and Men. <laughs> the Day My Hair Stood Still. All right, let's go with that. The Day My Hair Stood Still. Um, Happy anniversary. A story Nutter. of her. Gel, shampoo, and a slight breeze. It's going to be a win in this one. This is going to get more than $4, I'm telling you now. Should have been sleeping with Penny tonight, but you know. Just write a book instead. What's what? 2.30 a.m. Time to take the dog for a walk. Lil. <laughs> when he's done that. 2.30 a.m. cake, because why not? Doll has not been walked for days. It's gonna do one more friend. Play fetch, dance to some music, play in a puddle. That is so rubbish. Say bow. So, so. Wow, they're actually interacting with each other. That's amazing. <laughs> actually interacting. Ah. 
Mr. Bowie, names all. Oh. <laughs> Hang on. Didn't like that, whatever that was. Tell a joke about vampires. Lumpe Gore, Phil's and Chiche, Limna. <laughs> huh? Oh, Fidzel. It doesn't get his dad's humor at all. Marcus. This is bizarre. Bob gets on with absolutely everybody in this town, but his son is like, you're just not funny, Dad. Kazipa Nork. Chibadoo. Chibadoo. That's it. Just leave it there. It's okay. He's angry. Why is he angry? Clean that up. Clean that up. And then... Then I don't know. Watch TV. Jeff is angry because of his dad. It's weird. Right, how's he doing? He's probably getting hungry now. Book's about a third of the way done. <laughs> Jeff, what are you doing? I've told you to watch TV, Jeff. He's angry again. Take a cold shower to get while angry. <laughs> what? Take a cold shower. No, it's not angry because the cat scratches the sofa. He got angry when his dad started to say something to him. He's still angry. Take a cold shower. He's, he's, I think it's because he's not been to the gym for a couple of days. That's the book. Almost halfway. Energy levels are getting low. You might have to finish it tomorrow. It's the cat that made him mad, the red icon. Ah. Uh, I told him to take a cold shower. No, not cook. Mm. Try to swap the sofas. Why? You mean swap that one with that one? Why? Bob's like trying to write this story, getting stressed over. I like how they don't sit here anymore to eat food. They go into here. That's brilliant. Maybe I should put a TV here. <laughs> What achievement? Hang on. Uh, Bob finished writing an entire book. The book will be added to his inventory for future reading. Bob can also publish it. Just click on the mailbox. He finished his book already? Wow. Bob, dude. You deserve to eat something? Have a piece of cake, Bob. 
while we get your book published. Can I? Why can I only self-publish? I thought, how do I publish it via a publisher? Does anybody know? Going to the bedroom to eat as a teenager, absolutely. He's angry again. Mock someone. Ah, uh, the skill has to be higher. Got you. Okay. Well, we'll self publish it. See what happens. Um. Okay. <laughs> we'll just stand outside and eat the rest of the cake then. The red icon is a cat scratch symbol. I guess it's all about the scratch sofa. Okay, I don't know how to deal with that. I don't know how to train him. Fix the scratches, 90 credits. Wow. 90 credits of damage. Okay, Bob, take a shower and then go to sleep. Thank you, Rob. Okay. He is almost ready for work in 30 minutes. Let's play with Doll, that's fine. Year of the Squirrel 2017, 40 months. Hello, Paul. It's 18 degrees in New York, by the way. How was the box of chocolate? Um, eight, wait, 18 Celsius in New York, and it's like two Celsius here? How does that work? What's the weather here? Yeah, one Celsius outside. Getting down to minus two. That's ridiculous. Thank you for 14 months. Jeff's hospital shift is starting now. Let's do this. I'm convinced we can get a level out of this. Oh, unless he means Fahrenheit. Do you mean 18 Fahrenheit? In which case, I ain't got a clue what that means. Swab patient, chat with the patients. Let's see what we can do. Uh, let's chat with this one then. Friendly, brighten the day. Examen. Examen. I don't know how cold it is. I know 32 is zero, I think. I can't remember. It sounds cold then. Luke Frederick, thank you for subbing. Welcome to Nows, Luke. Thank you for your support. Thank you for the nutty welcome for Luke, guys. Uh, let's see. One sec. Uh, mop up a puddle. That's easy enough. Mop like mad. Where's that option come from? Scan a patient's body. Can't do that. Stop chatting with Cassandra. 18 Fahrenheit is minus 7. Okay, that's more like it. So a bit colder than here then. Um... I can't actually do any of the options yet. Successfully calibrate an x-ray machine. You can do that. Stop mopping puddles, Jeff. 
Just the one. I don't really get why they get you to mop puddles anyway, because you're not the janitor. Yeah, red heart means they've been diagnosed and they're ready for treatment, so I guess that means why I can't scan them properly. But the problem is, is like I have to wait for a patient to come through the door. Make a bed. Do that. In other words, you can't get XP. You can't do anything that gets you XP until patients start coming through the door. It's really annoying. Okay, that's a bed made. Give the patients a shot. Now we should be able to do that. Still not be coming. Patient cured, but that didn't count. Maybe that wasn't a shot then. Okay, I, I can't give a patient a shot because they're... Oh my god. So we can't do anything? I can't get more XP? Yeah, you can't transfer a patient case either. Because they're not mine to transfer. Well, you can apparently. Wait a sec, wait a sec, somebody just came in. Jalurba Kitsuni, Zimze Kohaven, Clevite Bainu. Scan a patient's body, how do you do that? Poor Jeff. Okay. I mean, why I don't? Why doesn't he just sit down? Why does he come to the door and stand here? Like, what? What's going on here? I'm just gonna go get another one because he's not sitting down. I don't know if it does an x-ray scan. Medical referral, refer to x-ray scan. Let's see what happens. It's okay. Let's go for a scan. <laughs> but my throat hurts. Well, let's have a scan anyway. You never know. That guy sat down, finally. So now we can swab. Don't think we can give these a shot at all. So that didn't count as scan a patient's body. I don't know why. So that, that hasn't counted. <laughs> you would not trust a doctor. What, Jeff is a clumsy doctor as well? <laughs> Refer for x-ray scan. Maybe that's what we need to do. 
Floss. Maybe that's what we need to do. She just had an x-ray, but she's having another one. Genius. <laughs> Jeff's like, well, you know that x-ray we just did? Yeah. It, it didn't come out all right. We need to do another one. What? He's embarrassed. Why is he embarrassed? Call someone on the phone. What? Why is he embarrassed? What's he done? Questionable exam results. Confused by the medical data, Jeff may need a second opinion on how not to be a bad doctor. Oh dear. Successfully performed an examination on the patient. See, I don't get this scanner patient's body. Wait, 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 wait. Scan body of a patient using a medical probe to check the vitals of a patient seated on an exam bed. Okay. So what options have I got then? Scan body. Great. Just on two x-rays for no reason. Fantastic. Okay, scan is done. Uh, check patient's ears. Lock sample results. I don't think he's going to ding today. See, all these want treating with starry eyes meds. Which doesn't count as giving a patient a shot. We're going to swab that and we're going to... Transfer that one. Brittany Overstreet, who's this? Some new person in town? I'm sorry, says Jeff. After two x-rays and a f various samples, I don't understand what's wrong with you. I'm transferring you to somebody else that what? actually knows what they're doing. Hello, bar. Darnay. Golarga Finosa. Marie Schroibel. Soyaya. Uh-huh. Slupa Sarzo. Lupla. Yibs. Origin is unreachable for you. If you click on the briefcase at the bottom toolbar, it'll give you progress, <laughs> career progress, and current performance proportion. <laughs> this one. <laughs> Promotion task three, treat three patients. We're doing okay. What do you for a promo? <laughs> T 
think I'm going to extend the day. See if we can uh, push the boat out on this. Can we treat him yet? We've got one more bed. <laughs> he's getting tired and hungry. But he's going to push it. There's a big shuffle going on here. Make way for the kid. Check her eyes. Morning up. Whoa, 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 stop. Uh scan the body. Examine, scan, examine, swap. Don't yawn in front of her. Of course, she's on the only working machine. Okay, we've just dinged it. And let's see. Jeff finishes his work in one hour and she's on the machine. Pretend to fire. <laughs> Pretend to fire. How can we... F okay. Mira and I. Mira. Yard. Oh, the action interface is terrible, Blackie. It really is. Like, things are hidden as well. Under more actions, you know? Makes no sense. Okay, scan a patient in an x-ray machine. I don't think we can get it done in an hour, but we'll see. It takes him like 30 minutes to walk from there to there. It's ridiculous. There you go. Jeff has been promoted to medical technologist. He will now make an additional 14 per hour for a grand total of 49. Uh, he's also received the following 312 bonus. Well, that'll pay for the bills. New clothes. Defeat the darkness surgical light. Medical treadmills can now be used further. Examine patient conditions. His next shift is on Wednesday at 9, so his day has been pushed back slightly as well. He's doing well. Mr. Rubku, how are you doing, sir? Thank you very much for the host, Rubku. Hope you're well. He's not done so bad. Bella the goth is wants to go out. Not a chance. Not a chance. Jeff Jeff is done. We're going to put Jeff on auto. Let him sort himself out. Okay, let's see what's going on with... Uh, 
Okay, so Bob's looking pretty cool over here. 6.17 p.m. on a Tuesday. Now, Bob could smack out another buck. Make himself useful. What, sh what should we do with Bob? He could go on a date with Penny. He could write another book. He could learn more handyman skills. I think he needs some skills. He could walk the dog. <laughs> dog is getting neglected. Tomorrow is your last day at work, Ruku. What for how long? Go on a day with Penny somewhere. All right, let's see what she thinks about that. Invite to hang out. Apparently I can't go on a date with her. I could invite her over. She's not seen the place yet. Let's invite her over and then see if we can go on a date. Let's see how that works out. No, Penny was in bed. Penny will be right over. Maybe I'll make her a nice meal. Uh, oh, you to me. <laughs> what was that? He just randomly went over and hugged his son just before Penny arrives. Wait, why is he angry? Oh, he's angry at that stupid thing, isn't he? Has to leave. Wait, why can't we let her in? Chew out. Throw drink. What the heck kind of options are these? How do I invite her in? There were some really weird options. She's not even knocked on the door. Uh, Tell her not not joke. I'm not getting the, the option to invite her on a date. <laughs> Ask about favorite author. How do we know if she even would like read stuff? Okay, so wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. I don't have the option to ask her on a date yet. I don't know what woohoo does, but it sounds fun. <laughs> That's brill. Oh man. You can just woohoo together. Uh what? Try for baby. Uh no. Um I can't why can't I just invite her in and just I don't know. Oh, here we go. Ask on a date. It's under a stupid menu. There we go. 8 p.m. Let's go out. Okay. Let's see. Club Coleco. Uh, Salty Paw Saloon. It's a cat hangout. Not available. Not available. Dog Friendly Park. <laughs> Some pretty weird options here. Let's go somewhere else. The library. The nightclub. The museum. The park. That sounds like a great date to me. 
It's not a haunted house. Um... Pool, the nightclub, cafe, the her and hedgehog cafe. What do we? What do we take her on a first night? I mean, the pool. No, the pool seems a bit of a weird first date, doesn't it? Uh, the park. There's, there's no like restaurant or something. San Musanir then. Party place, karaoke bar. Karaoke sound. I mean, karaoke could be fun, right? Or the Planet Honey Pop with great acoustics. Yeah, but the cinema's just going to be like, not much to do, isn't it? The Art Center. Great acoustics and natural light. I don't know if she's into the arts. I can't ask her to stay the night yet because the sun is in bed. <laughs> Fashion district. I'm gonna go here. Planet Honey Pop. You don't think restaurants exist? Do you not find that a bit weird? The idea of going to like Italian restaurants and like they give you tests to make pizza and things, that'd be funny. Right, the main goal socialize with your date, flirt with your date, sit and talk with your date. Oh god, it's not even open. Uh, there's nobody in here. <laughs> Sit together. With the only... Oh, there's people turning up now. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> Have Sims become playful at the same time? Profess on dying love. Wait, where are you going? Why do you have to stand up to do that? That counted as two or three. Uh, the sun is in the way a little. Have Sims become playful at the same time? I'm not really sure how to do that. That's what we want. Tell Joker what's. Why are you sitting down? This guy's so rude. What do you mean propose? We're not proposing yet. <laughs> Jeff, will you get up? Oh my God, Bob and me, not Jeff. Bob is so rude. Look where she's gone. She's had to sit at the other end of the bar. This is unbelievable. Flirt with your date while being flirty. I'm not sure how that works. Flirt while being flirty. Honestly, Bob is really annoying me right now. How can he possibly flirt across the other side of the bar? But how do you help playful things? Anybody know? Finally got out of his chair. Gotta get your mood to be flirty. Gotcha. So how do you do that? How do we get our mood flirting? <laughs> Just keep spamming flirt or something. Be funny, then be playful, okay. Okay, let's be funny. Oh, we're flirty now. We're definitely flirty now. Now he's bored? He's bored. I'm done with Bob. What is wrong with him? He was flirting and now he's bored. Oh god, she just he just did something she didn't like. 
Oh, this is unbelievable. I think he just told her that he's bored. Kiss your date passionately. This is ridiculous. Why is Bob hard work? He's reached level two charisma. I don't know how. He's happy now. <laughs> How do you get the? I don't get the kiss passionately one. Right now he's flirting. <laughs> what was that? Be enticing. <laughs> Bob, will you seriously stop walking off? <laughs> Passionate kiss. There it is. Dude, what are you? Oh my god, I just told him to do a passionate kiss and he sat down. Will you just not? There you go. Thank you. Oh man, I don't know who's hard to work, him or Penny, I think it's him. I need to get the funny one done. Have Sim to become playful at the same time. How do we get the f how do we get playful? Mischief? Tell Dirty Joke, maybe that'll do it. <laughs> I don't know how we get the playful one. He needs the toilet. You know what's going to happen now, don't you? Oh my god. Wait, why is he going? She's gone getting a glass of water. What is he doing? This guy is so rude, it's unreal. Yeah, he's gonna that's exactly what's gonna happen. He's gonna go for a bye break, she's gonna leave. Like I've told him to go to the toilet and he's still not doing it. Why won't he go to the toilet? This guy's an idiot. Five times I've told him to go to the toilet now. Have the bits come through yet, Jimmy? Hang on, just give me a second. Uh, take a picture together. Sexy pose? Bob, a sexy pose. Uh, Jimmy Turtle, 100 bits, loving the first stream of the new iPhone and could play Omti 2 over the new year and try the new DLCs. Oh. I don't know, Jimmy. Uh, Nordic Night Fury with 100 bits. Well, who is a bit not safe for work for a family stream, Law, by the way? What is your cat's name? I've missed most. Uh, Mer, Mer Whiskers, his name. I don't know, Jimmy. I'm about playing games and stuff. 
Let's get some cheek, take a picture together. Uh, offer a rose from nowhere. I see he's doing well. Dude, go away. <laughs> Make a flirtatious joke. Why has he got date complete, gold medal earned, legendary date, there is something special in your Sims household inventory to help remember it. Wow, that's fantastic. What did we get? Legendary date from Bob? You did it, Bob. Celebrate by jumping in rubbish. This guy is, is just a nutter. Let's go and discuss color theory with the guy with his jumper. I always do. I mean, after a legendary date, I used to jump in rubbish. Look, he loves discussing color theory. Why wouldn't he? Flash my crazy eyes at him now. Just to get the achievement. This is going to freak this guy out. No, he likes it. That's 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 worrying. He actually thought that was in. Pester someone. Hang on. Let me just impulsively pester him now. Oh, he didn't like that. He didn't like. That. That's good. That's good. Go home, Bob. You're done. How come he doesn't have a job, James? Because he's semi-retired. And anyway, he's learning to write. He's going to pull his weight by writing, publishing books. Legendary date from Bob. That's amazing. Uh, Tabali James, thank you for subbing. Welcome to us, Tabali James. Can we give James a nutty welcome, guys? Well, he doesn't technically have a job. He's self-employed, isn't he? You don't really have a job. He's not paid to do it. He gets paid as a result of doing it. Fun is really bad. Social's really bad. His fun is really bad. He's doing nothing but work. What's he doing now? Is he playing a game or has he gone social networking? Oh, he's not in a happy place. Play with the dog. Give him a bath. To the Jaws music. He's sad. He's so sad. Give him a bath. What's that? Untamed treachery of the heart. Where's he going? Just bath the dog. You also want a girlfriend? <laughs> My dad can pull an eye card. He's brilliant. He's embarrassed. Will you please, please bath the dog? Cannot unsee? <gasps> he just saw his dad naked in a shower and he's embarrassed. He's never seen that before. In his entire life, he's never seen that. Oh. 
Oh no, I've just seen my dad again. It's just as bad as last time. Okay. Stop walking to the front door every time you see your dad. Play with the smelly doyle. It's really weird. They, they, they keep coming to the front door and back again. Look. Of course, we have to play outside the front door. Why wouldn't we? Right, what's he doing? He's hungry. Penny. Might over. It's 5 a.m., Penny. I'm sure you'll be awake. Not at night, Fury. Penny is sleeping. Hello, Paul. Out of interest, have you ever played Sims 1, 2, or 3? I have played the original Sims, yeah. I can't remember which ones, though. I think th 1 and 3, I think. Have breakfast. Eggs and toast. There we go. There you go. His fun, fun bar's going up now. Maybe you can actually uh, give Doll a bath. It's this queuing system that annoys me. Like, if you give instructions to do things, and you expect them to do it, and then it just doesn't. Just removes things out of your queue and starts doing other things. That's the most frustrating bit. I think he just said, do you want a bath? Welcome back. And Doll was like, oh my god, please. So much effort. Ooh. Original electric ring. Uh, VW Golf, thank you for the resume. I know, Jacob. We, I think I will, because it's just... But even so, it, it still doesn't help properly. Wait a minute. Disable autonomy for... Disables autonomy for a selected household member while the other sims roam free on autonomy on. That sounds like more like a want. That sounds like more what I want. The one that I'm working on, I want you to do what I'm telling you to do, but the others can carry on. That's probably worked better. You scratch that sofa and I'm going to take your hat and sell it and pay for the repairs. Just saying. Ultimate free of charge, but not sure if it still applies if you fancy a nostalgic stream. Oh, Sims 2 Ultimate. Yeah, there's probably not much point in going back like that. I'm all right to play 4. People, Some people say 3 is better because 4 is just DLC all day. It's probably true. Uh-oh. Uh oh. That that is that doesn't look good, does it? <laughs> As a scene, that doesn't look very good. In comes the cat to drink the water. The bath water that bath doyle. It's just amazing. I don't know. Absolutely amazing. How often do the bills come in? Let's get rid of these uh get rid of them. I can't work out how often the bills come in. Right. I think we have to leave it there. Given the time. It's like 11 o'clock now. So yeah, I shall be back tomorrow. 5 o'clock with another stream. I hope you can join me then. I'm playing it off Origin, yeah. Can we get some GGs in chat for the mod team, guys? The modding splendidly once again. But I uh, hope you have a great Thursday, whatever you're doing. And I'll be back tomorrow. Uh, just to let you know, I don't know what I'm playing tomorrow, but just to let you know, on Saturday evening, uh, I think we're going to do uh, Seven Days to Die again. You know, carry on from last time, so we'll go for the second... You know what we did on... 
on last Saturday. We're going to do the same again. Uh, was it Saturday? No, Sunday. No, oh, was it Saturday? I can't remember now. You know the seven days to die. But we're going to up the difficulty considerably, is what we're going to do. So we'll be playing that on Saturday evening. I will be live on at 2 o'clock on Saturday. So I'm live tomorrow at 5. Live tomorrow on Saturday at 2. Then back for Sunday Night Trucking at 5. Live on New Year's Day at 5. So I'll be streaming next four days as well. The cat's scratching the furniture. I'm just going to let them two socialise. So yeah, have a good one. It was on Monday. There you go. <laughs> This week's a blur. <laughs> okay. Anyway. I hope you have a good Thursday. See you tomorrow at five. Take it easy, guys. Love you all. Good night.